Yeah, Wes Benedict for Williamson County Judge. Okay, I don't want this damn Mark Tippett for governor to sign uh, <laughs> <laughs> a video. <laughs> so you, you put it there. I'm going, oh, 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 yeah. <laughs> but it looked good earlier. <laughs> Thanks, my name is Wes Benedict. I'm running for Williamson County Judge. We're here in Travis County. Uh, a county judge is not really like a typical judge. It's more like a mayor, but for the county. <laughs> Um, and up in Williamson County, just like in Travis County, our taxes keep going up. They keep going up. Property taxes keep going up. Uh, Republicans will often say Democrats always want to raise money and spend money and raise your taxes. And yet wherever Republicans are in control, like in Williamson County or the state of Texas or when Donald Trump was president, sure enough, the amount of money we send to the government, the government keeps going up and up. So, as county judge and on the commissioner's court, we do have some control over uh, the county budget and uh, the county tax rate. And I want to lower tax rates enough so that even when property valuations go up, the actual check you write to the county for your taxes goes down. Sometimes Republicans will say, oh, we lowered the rate a little bit. When in reality, the bill you pay goes up from $8,000 to $12,000 because your property valuations go up so high. So we need to lower taxes for real, and I think it'll take a libertarian to make that happen. Um, I'm for free markets. I'm pro-business, pro-do whatever you want. But what we have going on in Williamson County, just like here in Travis County and most places around the country, is that the politicians get together they meet behind closed doors with big major corporations and they decide, hey, we'd like to give you a huge tax break. Like with Samsung, Kim Semiconductor, they just gave them a $200 million tax break to build a new plant here. Now, I'm for lower taxes, but I don't think it's fair that all of us pay higher and higher taxes and then a few lucky major corporations get tax breaks. I think Williamson County, even Travis County, the whole city of Austin, Texas, this is a good enough place that we don't have to bribe people to move here. People will move here as long as we keep government small and keep what the freedoms that we can. So no more handouts as far as I'm concerned if I'm in the county judge position. Third emphasis, uh, and this is my final, um, the war on drugs. People used to laugh at us about that. They used to laugh at libertarians when we say legalize marijuana. I would laugh too, you know, I'm thinking of Cheech and Chong and all those funny <laughs> movies. I mean, it's good, great stuff. Never thought it would actually happen. And you know, we've been saying this for, for years and years, for decades, and, and it's finally happening everywhere uh, throughout the country. Even President Biden did a small thing a couple days ago uh, to make it a little bit more legal. The law that put them all away. He, he, he first supported a lot of the very bad laws decades ago, yes. Well, you know, in Williamson County, if you look at the budget, and it's the same thing for most counties in, in the state, the county budget, most of it goes towards the criminal justice system. So that means paying for jails, the sheriffs and the sheriff's deputies, the justice of the peace, uh, the courts and lawyers, the, the criminal defense attorneys who have to who, who, who uh, represent people who have been arrested for this and that. So most of the budget goes towards crime, and a lot of that is related to the drug war. And so just like in the city of Austin where they said stop prosecuting marijuana users in, in Williamson County, I will work to do whatever's within our power to direct the sheriff's deputies, uh, the, the courts and whatever, to de-emphasize marijuana arrests and, and ignore them all together and not prosecute them if we can make that happen. Uh, I know we, we don't have total power over all that, but that's what we need to do. It's, it's almost like three quarters of the budget goes towards the criminal justice system and less than a quarter goes through towards the other major function, which is roads and transportation. So let's legalize marijuana in Texas. Let's stop prosecuting it in Williamson County and let's either direct more funds towards other more appropriate activities or lower your taxes. Thanks again. I'm Wes Benedict, running for County Judge, Williamson County. Thank you.